All right, guys, so uh, we, I just got down here at the field by my parents' house, and we got us another uh, coyote. Uh, glad to be back on the board, finally. I uh, haven't caught a coyote in probably about 10, 11 days, so I'm happy to have another coyote here. So we're going to go ahead and take care of this one. Uh, I'll flip the camera around. We got a feisty one this morning. So we're going to go ahead and take care of this one and get the rest of our line checked today. So I just want to show this uh, coyote here. Uh, got an awesome head catch here. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, you couldn't ask for a better catch on that one. Uh, this was the number two dogless. I uh, actually had a pullout on this one about two days ago, so... I'm guessing it's this dog, uh, and right there, that's the catch circle where we had the double that pulled out, so, you know, this might even be that dog that pulled out there, so we might have caught this one, but, uh, definitely glad to take the coyotes out of this field here, uh, we're just right next to my mom and dad's house, and they've been saying for a couple months where they just, they hear coyotes here all the time, and it keeps their dogs up all night barking, so. Definitely glad to be taking this one out. Well, we just came up on the hill from where we caught that coyote, and uh, the spot where we've been catching a bunch of our coons, I threw in another DP behind it yesterday, and got us another coon in that DP I put out yesterday. So we're going to go down here, and I'm going to get some footage of it real quick. So here's the dog proof that I've been catching my coons on up here. Well, this trail goes right through here, and I decided to put in another one. And we got us a big old coon down there. So this one's probably about the size of the one I got yesterday. Maybe just a tad bit smaller. Gotta walk through the briars here. So, yeah, got us a nice little coon. So, got us a coyote and a coon so far. So this has been a pretty good day for us. Uh, the weather got quite a bit colder last night, which I've been waiting for. It was, I think, 38, so good weather definitely produces fur. <laughs> so uh, I'm driving down this hill now where we just caught that raccoon. We go check our third piece, uh, our new property, which is our third piece here. Uh, I'm going to go check it right now. Bumpy road. But uh, I was just going to mention, I forgot to mention the video, but... Uh, the coyote we caught, uh, I caught it on the Deadly Highway 71 in Trapper's Gold. And the raccoon I caught on dry dog food and persimmon coon syrup. So, I've been catching quite a few with that persimmon coon syrup. And we're catching a lot on the uh, Little Sugar Creek Road. Uh, so, I've been catching quite a few. Uh, hopefully, we've got some more in this other property. Got to go check. So, uh, just stay tuned. So we're down here on our third spot checking our traps. And I'm right here where we caught that little possum yesterday where I had the pull out on the Diablo DP. Well, I just got over here and got something else. So somehow we got another pull out on the Diablo. Something got around this limb and pulled out. So that's two days in a row. I've got to pull out on this Diablo. Not sure what the deal is here. If anybody can kind of tell me what I might, maybe I'm doing something wrong. I don't know. This is the second day in a row I've had a pull out on this Diablo. So I'm going to go ahead and take that trap out because two pull outs in two days, that's obviously not doing me any good so I'm just gonna go ahead and pull this trap out and y'all can tell me maybe I'm doing something wrong I don't know so we'll see all right so I went and checked the rest of the line and we didn't have anything else so uh, uh, I mean a coyote and a coon is pretty good especially compared to what we've been doing here lately uh, 
We're gonna try to get some more land here pretty soon to trap. Uh, that big farm that I was gonna trap, I haven't heard back from them yet, so hopefully we can get some new properties here pretty soon. Uh, it'll extend our line quite a bit. But uh, again, I wanna thank you all for watching. Uh, I didn't really have, I don't have time to set any new sets today because uh, I've got to be at church in less than an hour or so. Uh, I'm going to go home and get ready and get changed for church and I'm going to go to church. So maybe tomorrow I can get a few new sets out. So again, I want to thank you all for watching and hope you guys have a great day and have a great rest of your traveling season. Thank you.